Welcome back to the PPL and welcome back to the second encounter of the day. It's come down to the mixed double. It's gone come down to match three between the Las Vegas Smash and the Houston Vaults. And in this mixed double, we have Claudia Fernandez and Alex Chozas on one side and Marta Ortega and Gonzalo Alfonso on the other. It's a, a one set encounter. And should it go down to the tie break, it will not be a regular tie break, but a super tie break, as it is called. So up to 10 points rather than up to seven. Up in the up until now, however, none of the uh, none of the mixed double matches have actually gone to the tie break, but that is just in case it does happen. So one set to decide if it's Vegas or Houston who gets the W today. Chozas just bested by Gonzalo Alfonso, Ortega just bested by Claudia Fernandez, who will come out on top in this one. Very, very interesting matchup to say the least. My name is Nicholas Quarles, Sven Effort. Everyone, thank you still for being with us here on the PPL English live stream from uh, Center Court. Alongside me, Ceci Reiter. Ceci, uh, again, in always interesting to see these mixed doubles because the dynamic of the match completely changes, especially as uh, in the women's match, Claudia Fernandez really got the better of Marta Ortega and then some. And I think it's fair to say in the men's match that Gonzalo Alfonso got the better of Alex Chozas. So that makes for an even, even more sort of odd dynamic that's going on between the two teams. Yes, that's why it will be very interesting to see how these two couples can uh, start playing together. No, it's fair to say that uh, Claudia Fernandez absolutely dominated Marta Ortega in that cross court. For me, the male cross court <laughs> was uh, battle was more tied up. Yeah. No, because uh, Gonza uh, won many points, but uh, Alex Chosas also had. Uh, many chances no in the second set they got the chance to force a super tie break definition in the last moment they couldn't but for me the most interesting thing now is to see how the weather conditions can affect because the ball is going really fast in Nico right now we have seen many smashes and we have two strikers on court but we have only uh, we have two women so yeah. how will the boys <laughs> control that kind of power knowing that perhaps they have a girl in front of them. Yeah, always interesting to see how that uh, gets turned into reality, shall we say. Gonzalo Alfonso, speaking of smashes, was absolutely whacking the ball from anywhere on the court. Seemed to really have uh, a good touch there. Yes, in the previous two events, Alfonso and Martita, they played really well together. Let's see if they can repeat the same performance today here at San Diego. The match that Claudia Fernandez and Lorena Rufo played earlier is, uh, if you can, if you could frame it and hang it in the museum, that was one of the all-time performances. And speaking of Gonzalo Alfonso, he's just flown over from Marbella and he took flight there again. He doesn't seem to have any jet lag. It's nine hours of difference. Yeah, I know. I the it was the same for me. <laughs> yes, but you are not playing. I'm not playing. Nico, no. You are here sitting with me. No, I tried to go for a run the day after <laughs> I got here, and it was it was difficult. <laughs> and that was just a, a, a 30 minute workout, let alone three matches. This is now his third match, I think. Yes, the third paddle. match for him. Yeah, because. And of course, Claudia trying to oh. get the best of Marta again. Gonza <laughs> read perfectly that he was going to play a drop shot. Gonzalo Alfonso with another winner. These are three break points for Vegas. Ortega holding her own, lobbing it over Claudia Fernandez. Good defense from Claudia from the back. Trying to play Chiquita then. Wow, what a lot from uh, Chosas. Yeah, stayed in Ortega. 
up at Vianzi, playing it with pace. Marta looks much more better than in the female match. Okay, Gonzalo Alfonso. He is red hot today. Absolutely on fire. And it Las Vegas break straight away. Nico, before the male match started, we said that from the four players, perhaps the <laughs> the 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 other three strikers were better than Gonzalo yeah. and then he came out as the best yeah. of the four of them. Absolutely. He has really uh, shut us up in that way. Yeah. And they got the first break. Yeah, it's smash after smash after smash. We can make a special clip from him <laughs> with all the smashes he won today. But in the interview, they both uh, say that the conditions were very different from yesterday afternoon, where the ball was heaviest. Oh, ah. that was it as well from Alfonso. Stop it, Gonzalo Alfonso. How did she? Everything he touches turns into gold right now. No, amazing, Nico. It was gorgeous. Good love now. And again, Alfonso crossing all over the net to touch that ball and put it where it was impossible to defend. That from must Chosos. be six or, or seven winners already for Gonzalo Alfonso. It seems like Martita has to do nothing at all <laughs> today. That time, Claudia Fernandez does accelerate well. Perhaps they need to start thinking about freezing Alfonso a little bit. Mm. Oh, that was in. That was in from Ortega. Yes, yeah. an awkward rebound. Right at Claudia Fernandez, and then the finishing touch from Alfonso. 2 0. Easy as that. And now we can say that uh, Houston are leading the series, or I mean, uh, Las Vegas, excuse me, are leading the series for the very first time. Behind the back, <laughs> Ortega. Showing that she has some magic to show us. Now that love from Chosas is way out of court. All. Nice volley from Claudia Fernandez. Yes. Perhaps the balls need that Claudia start playing that cross court, avoiding uh, Gonzalo to, parti to participate. Vega going at Chotas. Oh, when uh, Alfonso. Capable of making a mistake then. <laughs> He's the kind of player you always want to see him now playing. You always want to see him on court. That's gone way out from Claudia Fernandez. Yes, and Claudia getting frustrated right now. It's not the Claudia we saw before. Yeah, the Claudia we saw earlier was uh, it was a thing of beauty to see her playing that way. It's certainly not at that level right now, but not really her own fault, it's more that the her her rivals 
are not letting her play that way. And Alex Jothas has something to say about that as well. Nice hits from Jothas from the Argentinian. So it's still uh, La Vegas in front, and this is a great time to have another look at this absolute work of art from Gonzalo Alfonso. This is the type of stuff that you maybe do in training, that you maybe try when you're having fun with your friends, but to do this in an actual match, that is filth, absolute filth from Gonzalo Alfonso. Gonzalo Alfonso to serve. They keep the break of advantage. That ball from Claudia was out, 15 love. Love from uh, Alfonso, from just as now. Matita with the Vibra, now with the Chiquita. Bajada from Marta and Alex claiming that love for him to win the point with the smash, 15-0. So with that volley, which finally hit the body of Claudia. 30-15. Ball ball for Ortega from Chofas. Alfonso is there to lend a helping hand, and Chofas showing no sympathy at all. Alex Chofas just lets rip. Yes, I think that Chofas it's a little bit upset knowing he's starting to cover the back of uh, Claudia. Oh, Ortega and Alfonso are getting in each other's way here. It's 30-40, the yeah. first break point for the Bolts. Back to earth a little bit are uh, the smash, but speaking of the smash, there is one. Alex Josas will receive or will return. But it's a poor return and Alfonso lets him know about it. Yes, not a good return from Chosas. Too short and too easy for Gonz Alfonso to finally kill that ball. 3-1, smash. Las Vegas is smash, keep the distance. Vega looking a bit frustrated out there. Nice passing show from Marta Ortega. Alfonso takes over. Can he get to that one? No, he cannot. Just ran out of room. Beautiful return from Ortega. Very, very well played by Marta Ortega.
firing at will, but only finding the net. 40-50, Nico. High love from Marta. Sure, best thought about it. No, that ball was out. It went. Back on court, back on action. Las Vegas and Mash still with the lead, still with that break of advantage. Now they are seven, 15 all. Thirty fifteen Martita with the Bibra Claudia Guet with a good defense putting that ball in the corner. Alfonso okay. steps in to devastating effect. <laughs> Extremely well read by Gonzalo Alfonso once more. Yes, he's like fishing on the net, trying to catch every ball he can. And Claudia doesn't look at all as we have seen it before. Yeah, it's Many like mistakes today, right now. It's like day and night with Claudia Fernandez. It's 4 2 for Las Vegas. Real near to close this series for them. And now. Alex just uh, punishing yeah. that ball. 15 love. Fernandez has taken the shades off and look at that for a passing shot from Marta Ortega. Threading the needle. Chavaz takes it off Fernandez, almost steps over her. <laughs> yes, and Claudia didn't know that she was going to be almost. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she was in the jumped line of fire, fire there. Yes, just as almost have to jump over Claudia's Fernandez. <laughs> A 
Alfonso likes to look at that one and gets it to go as well. Tried to take it early, the Chozas. Yes, because he knows that uh, he wouldn't have any chance then. Oh, Ortega tried it again, less successfully this time. Yes, and it's 40-30 for the Bolts to keep their service alive. Good volley from Chozas, putting some pressure. Chothas left the big gap here. Ortega plays it into the gap. Chothas lifts up the lob. And Gonzalo Alfonso is there as he has been all match long, as he has been all day long. Gold point. No surprises there. Alfonso will return. Yeah, he can't and get away uh, with a lob like that against uh, Gonzalo. Yes, and Nico, they have another chance to break, to get the second break of the set. That but, yeah. could be finally lethal. They'd be serving for the match, remember. It's only a one-set match, this, but they won't get it. Chozas and Fernandez saving their bacon. It is 4-3 uh, still, though, and a one-break one, uh, advantage, I should say, for Vegas. and Fonso to serve. They still lead 4-3. Claudia with the approach into the net. Finally, the mistake from Chossas, 15 love. That's the kind of shot that is uh, almost never going to work. Uh, Another one that goes straight out. Yes, uh, Chossas totally disconnected from the match. And also Claudia Fernandez, three unforced errors in a row for yeah. the Bolts. All on the same wall as well. Yeah. All trying to play a lob of Ortega, who plays down a beautiful Vibora there, by the way. Surely this is not the way to come back from the Bolts. Oh, Alfonso is unlucky there. Doesn't get help from the Nets, who guides it out of the court. And uh, misunderstanding there in the middle between Marta and Gonzalo. 40-30. Second serve. Nice we were now from Ortega. Oh, and a oh. beautiful follow-up as well. Somehow saved by Chozas and Ortega says, all right, no problem, I'll do it again. Game for the smash, 5-3, and they are one game away from securing this win for Vegas.
very different story in that cross court between Marta Ortega and Claudia Fernandez right now in this mixed double match. Ah, Alfonso just got his angles all wrong there. Yes, but the anticipation was perfect. Good love from Alfonso now. Another unforced error from uh, Chosas. Chosas. Yeah. He's had a quite a few of them now. Yes. He's not uh, concentrated, it seems to me. So out of the game. Good defense. There. The back wall and the jump smash from Chosas and another unforced error from Alex Chosas, who's just not enjoying himself out there. No, he's very upset. 15.30. This can end quickly, Nico. Drop shot. It's a beautiful one from Claudia Fernandez. They need more of that. We've seen plenty of that in the, the women's doubles earlier. Now he got the winner with the smash, 40-30. Good pressure with the volleys. Couple of very sharp volleys, and now one from Claudia Fernandez who tries another drop shot. Gonzalo Alfonso putting on the afterburners, but Ortega cannot reach the follow-up volley. So Houston does enough to stay alive, but now comes the tricky parts because when we come back, the Las Vegas smash serve for the match. And here we go again. Let's see if uh, Las Vegas smash can close the set and the match. And the series. And the series, of course, Nico, with this service game. Not oh, the best there. way to start. No, he thought he had an easy smash, but he was uh, stuck between a rock and a hard place there with that smash. It didn't go out and it didn't go off the glass. Generally speaking, when you smash, you always want to avoid the uh, the fence that is above the back glass because it slows down the ball tremendously. It's just a risk you do not want to take, generally speaking. Sometimes it can deflect wide or back to your courts, but double faults from Marta Ortega. Love 30. Love 30, oh, what a moment to commit a double fault. Not usual at all to see many double faults in paddle. Nice ball from Alfonso. Takes this off Ortega and smashes it back across. That's more like it from Gonzalo Alfonso. A 
lob over Ortega. Oh, and it stays in for Marta Ortega. Incredible surgical precision. Just like she is a doctor. Yeah. No, Nico? <laughs> exactly. Beautiful backhand volley from Martita. Press it now with the Vibra. Big time pressure on Claudia Fernandez who takes net position. Nice lob from Alfonso to pin her back again. Will he try it? Yes, he will. Will he get it? Yes, he will. Gonzalo Alfonso taking over. 40-30 and two match points, two series points for Vegas. Yes, Nico, they are about to get their second win of the week. for the win and they get it it's a royal flush for the las vegas smash who come back from behind to win the series against the houston vaults by two games to one ortega and alfonso get the job done six four in this mixed double yes a great performance from gonzalo and marta they are they look to enjoy a lot to play together no that's why this, uh, they got this victory for their team. It's not the first one. They have played together in the first two events of this regular season in April in Miami. And they repeated victory. Let's have a look at the Adidas smash of the match. And is this one from who else but uh, Gonzalo Alfonso. From the back of the court, doesn't matter. Still got it to go. What a performance he has shown in both of his matches today. Gonzalo Alfonso brings home the win. In both of his, ma his matches for Las Vegas, very much the MVP of the day for the smash. The Argentinian getting the job done together with Marta Ortega, Ortega herself, who had a brilliant game here. Yes, nothing to do with the one he had before. she had before mm. in the female match. I really stepped up her game for this uh, mixed double. Did Marta Ortega, and I think uh, herself, and Gonzalo Alfonso are standing by courtside. Let's hear from them in the flash interview. There, mixed doubles, and of course, starting with Marta. Marta, again, a great, a great performance. Lots of questions were asked, but you guys came up with the answers each and every time. Cada vez que hubo un momento de duda, ustedes salieron en este último set y, y, y totalmente despejaron cualquier tipo de, de, de interrogante. Yo creo que la clave ha sido que sabíamos que era o todo that, nada, uh, así que hemos entrado muy concentrados, también muy motivados so we were, uh, y como Gonzalo la verdad que es súper fácil jugar, la tiene muy yeah. clara and, uh, y hemos intentado Gonzalo, hacerlo lo mejor posible very y sobre todo darlo todo, que es lo que se merecía todo el equipo. And, uh, we knew we had to go all win. out, That's of course, in a, in a setting like this one, it's it's one set, it's all or nothing, so we knew we had to give it all, of course, having a partner like Gonzalo makes things a lot easier. He had it very clear in terms of what he had to do, thus making it easier for her as well. Gonzalo, otra vez saliste, otra vez la rompiste, otra vez, y especialmente con un margen de error tan mínimo que hay en un formato de un set, contame un poco de la mente, un poco el chip. There is almost no margin for error, and you were perfect. La verdad que estoy muy contento por darle este punto al equipo, se lo Creo que habla muy bien, muy bien del equipo lo que, lo que hicimos hoy. Eh, think, nada, estoy uh, pasando un momento increíble, disfrutándolo un montón, así que esperemos que esto, esto dure lo, lo, que más, lo que más se pueda. Y nada, un placer jugar con Martita y dar este punto eh, tan importante para Las Vegas. ¡Vamos Las Vegas! And let's go Vegas. He's happy that he's going through a great run of form. He's happy, of course, he's going to try and ride that wave as much as he possibly can. And, and obviously, knowing what, what was at stake, he knew he had to play his best. And also having a partner like Martha makes, a lot, makes life a lot, lot easier for him in order to be able to get the result that they did. So congratulations to Las Vegas. They'll continue on. They'll continue battling on for the title here in San Diego. We'll have lots more action. Don't go. We'll be back top of the hour with much more as we have lots of action here in the Pro Battle League.
Congratulations then once again to the Las Vegas Smash who come back from a match down to win the series two matches to one against the Houston Volts. And uh, Gonzalo Alfonso says he proving himself absolutely vital for the Smash. He almost by himself, well not really by himself, but the MVP of both of his matches for Vegas. Yes, Vegas should be really thankful that Gonzalo had flown all the way from Arbella to come here and be here with his team. What a commitment from him again with his partners. He looks like he's enjoying a lot. He's, he enjoys uh, the team competition. Here we got the stats of the match, Nico. Less than half an hour played, 29 minutes. And uh, both teams with two break points. The difference is Vegas took one of them, at least. Houston had two, didn't take it. and. Uh, We'll be back shortly at 5 p.m.